no. my breath, yeah. Right. But meanwhile, Howard, I'll tell you what I'm a little brokenhearted about. Go ahead. I did see a picture of people of a beautiful blonde, like that they took a picture of her going in and out of your house. So yeah, he can't get away from her. <laughs> yeah, she's chasing him. So you like blondes? So this is all. Myth. No, 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 no. Listen, let me tell you something. What? I like all types. Your mo is out. I like all types. <laughs> no, I am seeing someone right now, but uh, the fact of the matter is, it's just because she happens to be blonde doesn't mean I only would go with a blonde. Okay. You know I what I mean. All right. Sure. Just try. Just dye your hair blonde. Let's get going. That's all. Hey, on our phone right now. Speaking yes. of dates. I don't even know if I should put her on the air. I'm so mad at her. Is this Lila? It's Lila from Son of the Beach. Are you speaking to her? You haven't talked to her? I haven't spoken to her. I've been so angry I don't want to speak to her. I think you're afraid. No, I'm not afraid. <laughs> afraid she'll tell something else. Yeah, I kind of don't even want to go near her. She's the only one of my friends who's ever come over to my apartment and then told everybody what goes on there. Well, are we just going to talk about her? Or you All right, I'll put her on. Hello, Lila. Good morning. Don't mistake me. Put Look, you on the air for nothing. Don't put the charm here. Yeah, girl. It's not going to work anymore. <laughs> we are officially not. We're not friends anymore. I don't even know what happened. What happened? You know, you went on a show and you, you talked about. What does she mean? She doesn't know what happened. Why is she on the phone? Yeah. I don't because the boys told me that you're mad at me, and so I'm. I'm not mad at you. Then you don't. Then you don't have to worry about it. Okay. I don't even want to talk about it. Well, what what happened? Because I. You know I, what happened. Robin's right. You know exactly what happened. But I know all the all the interviews that I do, Howard. I only say what's already been said on your show. No, you. But you. You, know, you, 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 you don't have to talk about the bedroom and the and the how you get into the apartment and the. I don't no. even want to. I don't even want to That's say. That's never been said on the show. Never been said. Never I, been I don't know. About. It just kind of was embarrassing. Oh. Not well. that I don't do that to other people, but I just don't want it done to me. <laughs> I am so sorry. I had no, I I really didn't think that I was crossing the line. You know, I respect your privacy. No, you don't. I do. Because you try to make it seem like we like I tried to get you in the bedroom and stuff. I, I was oh. a total gentleman, oh, and then you no. made me sound all goofy. Like I you sat there watch, like I sit there and watch like Son the of the Beach with you. He showed you was the bedroom. I showed you Son of the Beach because because <laughs> oh you hadn't God. seen That's it. So retarded. It was a it was an internet interview, Howard, and the and the person who was doing the interview was Chauncey. She was paraphrasing what we were saying. No, I, I heard the whole... He sent me the interview. I heard it. You didn't okay. paraphrase anything. Everything came from you. Well, I just I didn't make it sound like you were trying to like, jump on me or anything like that. I just thought you were cool. I thought we were friends. We are. No. I have no friends. Oh, my God. Oh, thanks a lot. Just because Lila screws up, now nobody's your friend. That's right. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. I didn't, I didn't think it was sounding like that at all. Well, I mean, I brought you into the inner sanctum. I thought you'd be a little, well, I a little know, cooler. I don't. I didn't really. It, it, I yeah. had you up to my place because you're my friend, and you know, I figured you were. We were friends. I wasn't putting any moves on you. I, and then all of a sudden, it became. You have to see Howard at his apartment. Yeah. And then he he watches Son of the Beach. All yeah. The time. I mean, you made me sound like a douchebag. <laughs> like I sit up there in my. Of the beach. Of course you watch Son of the Beach. But you made it seem like I have a girl over, like I have a girl over, and I make them watch Son of the Beach. I don't do that. I, you're in Son of the Beach, and you hadn't seen it yet. I know. Why did you try to make it sound like that, Howard? Give me a break. Oh, I should play the interview. Is it, I won't hear the interview because it was the beginning of the season for Son of the Beach. I'll I play the interview. To have dinner. It was a nice, we're friends dinner. I never thought that you were going to try to... He showed you know, me the whole apartment, and the last place he shows me is his bedroom. You heard the interview, right? No, I haven't heard a oh. thing. I, I, you know what? Someone brought by the interview for Robin. I stole it. <laughs> he wouldn't let me in. I'm embarrassed. It's embarrassing. <laughs> How do I feel bad for her? Who? What? Andrea. She got stiffed again. <laughs> <laughs> Andrea hasn't had any of this treatment. Well, she's going to get it. I'm sure well. some of the beach. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, I mean, I, seriously, I had you up to the apartment because I don't, I don't know. I just thought it was cool. We we were talking on the show. You hadn't seen Son of the Beach. I was proud of my apartment. I wanted to show it to you and everything. Oh, but I did, your apartment's beautiful. But I didn't I, think you would I, blab about it all over the goddamn yeah, internet. Whenever you go to visit a friend and you have never been to the house, they always give you a tour of the house. Yeah, I mean, you kind of, you were kind of curious, and I said, okay, I'll give you a tour. That's normal. I wanted to see it. Your your place is awesome. Yeah, but let's keep it between us. Is there nothing private? 
that you have the you have the of ads. What? I don't want to hear about what my, I don't. Thank God her phone is crapping out. <laughs> I'm so mad at her. Because she's giving us more details. Yeah. No, she's just not discreet. <laughs> Lila? Oh, she's gone. Her phone crapped out. And if she's still listening, I want to thank her for those beautiful pictures she sold me on eBay of your apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Lila is gone. Now, Andrea, if you came up to my place, you wouldn't be blabbing all over the uh, Internet about my apartment, would you? Hell no. No. No, you'd just be part of a screenplay. <laughs> yeah. The disc jockey and the writer. A new screenplay. Well, I have to take a break, and then we're going to do the news. I should play you that Lila interview. I, I've been dying to hear it. I can't get a copy. Want to know something I'm so embarrassed by it? I don't play it, but I will play it. Want to well, hear you have it? to be embarrassed about it. How come strangers can hear it and I can't? All right, i tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to play it on the air tomorrow. All right. Hey, Alex? Yeah. She's, she's back. Oh. Oh, no. Why too? Lila. Okay, I'm back. I'm, I'm in a bad area. I'm on my way to work. Oh, you don't, you're in a really you, bad you, area right now. Yeah, <laughs> you're about in the worst area. You just don't know how bad an area you're in. Funny, where I grew up, when someone said you're in a bad area, it was usually like a black and Puerto Rican neighborhood. <laughs> but now it's like a bad cell phone area. I'm on my way to Son of the Beach. I'm on the beach right now. Right. Well, Lila's in tonight's episode, and she has a, uh, a whole story. Like, she actually works with a dog. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, uh, I have to train to feed the dog so that uh, he can beat Roland. Chip dog, I'm right. sorry. Listen, she's a nice looking girl. I, I mean, listen, Lila you and I. Were, you were lulled into thinking. I thought we were friends. You could have an, a, a relationship I, with her. I, but I realized maybe I was just wrong. Howard, you are so not wrong. I did not realize that I was invading your privacy by releasing those little. I didn't think that there were major details. I'm so sorry. I just sound like an idiot. No, you didn't sound like an idiot at all. No, no, nah, nah. it's like I take you up to my apartment, and I'm like showing you all my gear, and, and then like a, a special way you have to get in. Even a special way. You gotta and, see Howard in his apartment. Yeah, and it's just like you know. And the then, last then, room he shows you is the bedroom. Then we had dinner, and he showed me the bedroom, and then and then he puts on episodes of Son of the Beach. <laughs> I mean, you made me sound like a total tool. And Sunset Boulevard. I mean, I'm a tool. I'm, I'm listening to this. I go, you know what? Stern's a tool. <laughs> No, not. That's all right, but you know what? You taught me a valuable lesson. Oh, I, I have to be more careful with the people I bring into the apartment. You're right. An even more important lesson: you control the scripts. Next week there'll be a, a, a preview on FX. This <laughs> week, Lila Drums. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, you know what? I would never let it affect the working relationship. <laughs> Lila does a fine job. Oh, the, seriously, though, I'm so seriously. I didn't. I, I didn't mean to make you sound like a... a no, nah, you taught me a valuable lesson. You taught me a lesson. I, seriously, thank you. Better better you teach It'll me a lesson. It'll again, never happen right? again. No way. Nobody's getting up there. I will only date deaf, mute, and illiterate women. <laughs> like my mom. Right, like your mother. Oh. That is right. Where is your mother? That's true. Oh, she down for me. Yeah, wait, wait. My date is on the phone. She wants to talk. It's like... That's what I'm going to go out with. No one will know what she's talking about. Hey, get away you from my mom. You did. Son of the beat. <laughs> oh, my God. And please don't talk about the friendship ring I gave you. Uh. <laughs> See? You joke around. No, I'm joking. You were serious. People take things too literally, though, sometimes. You and, know you know, and with her, like, if she goes out with a guy, she's all secretive. You she can't goes even out... get her to name who she's dating. No, you can't even. Like, Except on the... you never dating, Howard. You and me, we were always friends. I know, but you made it sound like I was dating you. No, I, I did not. Oh, you. you said you went on a dream date with me. And then I oh, sound like a total tool. Everyone calls it at any date with you a dream date, Howard. I was That's so freaking insane. embarrassed, Robin. So many women I'm telling you, Lila, he's never withheld tape from me before. It's the first time ever I've withheld tape. <laughs> he shared everything with me I except your me. tape. And just because oh I just, just because I should confront all of my fears, I will play the tape tomorrow. <laughs> Do it. Don't be scared. Well, I am it'll scared. Be, it'll be, be your tornado. Hey Sam, hey, Sam, you're booked on the show tomorrow, right? Oh, no, you're not. No, oh, right. good. Then I'll play it. I don't need you ridiculing me. <laughs> Uh, I'll call in. Oh, don't play the tape. Don't play it. No, I got to because it's out there anyway, and you've already just reduced me to being an idiot. You're, you, why are you an idiot? You're the coolest guy ever. Nah, you must hate me. On some level, you must like think, well, you, you know what? there's a subconscious yeah. kind of thing going on there. I thought she really liked me. And I don't mean like me. I don't, I, I seriously. You don't mean like you like you. No, I don't no, think there'd ever be anything romantic between me and Lila. I don't think it's that kind of relationship. But you thought there was a friendship. But I liked her. I mean, she's like, was kind of a cool chick, and I thought mm -hmm. we had. Yeah, you know things about me that I wouldn't want you to say on the radio. And I, I never would. And I never would. 
And I know, and I don't think, I didn't think that, you know, I was saying anything wrong. I'm well, so maybe sorry. you're not thinking it's anything wrong. Tell me everything. I know. Yeah, <laughs> never, I'll never, if anyone ever, I'll never ask for any questions. That's all right. Don't worry about it. It's water under the bridge. Aww. It's just, it's, you, just, you know, at some point you get a certain level of fame. You just don't know who you can trust. Yeah, I guess. You don't know why they like you. <laughs> you know, maybe they like, I guess you just like me for, because I was famous. Your apartment. For my apartment. Because I heard you had a splendid apartment. Yes. Well, I hope you're happy in the relationship you're in now. Who are you seeing now? Oh, I got somebody. See? See Why don't you give us no name? name. Have you been to his apartment? Do you have a name? Are you saying your name on the air? Yeah, I'm saying my name. It's Howard. <laughs> no, not Howard your name. Stern. Are, are you seeing someone? Yes, I am. I said the name yesterday on the air. I'm not sitting. And, uh, yes, I did. So, wait a minute. What is your new uh, boyfriend's apartment like? And what does he do when you come home? Yeah, let's hear I've about never, it. I've never it's been there. I just started cameras. talking to him. Is your, par is your boyfriend famous? No, I've, I've never been there. I just started talking to him. Is he famous? I don't think so. Is he well known? What does he do? I don't know. I haven't asked him about it yet. Mm, yes, yeah, see? Please. <laughs> she knows yeah, nothing she all knows, of a sudden. She knows how not to say anything about she him. She keeps her mouth shut about mm. him. <laughs> By the way, in case you didn't hear, Vivica A. Fox is replacing you next season. <laughs> oh, <great>. <laughs> She's strictly <laughs> dickly. <laughs> She's strictly dickly. Yeah, so I'm there. fired. I'm fired. Oh. No, you're not fired. I, that, that has nothing to do with your work. You're good on the show, but... Just, and you're easy on the eyes. It's a good and you're easy on the eyes, but you're just a disappointment as a friend. Hey, is your so new boyfriend, sorry. is he no, well hung? What? I said, I'm so sorry. Please accept my apology. That nah, it's no, it's no big deal. It's no big, I, just, I just felt like a tool. I don't think you should have. I think you're you're always awesome. Well, you're actually, awesome. I didn't hear it, so I don't know if he's overreacting or not. I might be. I, know he was very upset. I might be. I heard it, and I was like, I don't know. It just sounded like a tool. Like like I was like putting the moves on her, and I brought her into the bedroom, and I saved her for last, and then mm. and then I had oh. secret codes at my apartment, and then and then all of a sudden, uh, He's um, watching son of yeah, a like beach. I, I lo we sat on a couch and watched Son of a Beach, and I'm like, you know. God damn. No, it was all tongue in cheek. Al Pacino, you know, because you're Al famous. Well, Al Pacino's my father, but every time I, somebody wants to change my diapers, it comes in the, out the National Choir the next week. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. We're Sam Tennyson. <laughs> all right. We're Listen, back. um. <laughs> Are you going to watch the show tonight, Howard? Yes, I am. I love it, Son of the Beach. With a gun to my head. And, Are you uh, watching, Robin? Oh, yeah, of course I am. Stay up that late, 10 o'clock late for you. I tape it. She tapes. I watch it the next okay. day. Yeah. Okay, good, good. <laughs> and whatever you do, don't fly to New York secretly. Enter my apartment and wait for me in the bedroom. Don't do that. <laughs> uh, okay, I, I won't use your entry code and, and get past all your uh, security and everything. All right, Lila, thank you. <laughs> mm. All right, well, you guys take care. Take care, Lila. Uh, all right, bye-bye. Don't get in trouble again. No, you're not in trouble. Okay. All right, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Mm -hmm. well, I'm not making friends with anybody. Oh, dear. I'll stick with the friends Jesse. I have. <laughs> it was no big deal, okay? Fine. So I'm a tool. I'm a total load. Oh, dear. My fortress of solitude was invaded. For once, I let somebody in. And what happens? It all goes wrong. It's during a, a, a screwy, Chauncey Hayden interview on the Internet. Of all places. Of all places. If you're going to do it, wait do it for somewhere. People Magazine. Yeah, do it on The View. <laughs> Not the Chauncey Hayden. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. You All right. Bet. What? Leave me alone. You bet. Yeah. Leave me alone. Me <laughs> yeah. Oh. Why me? Why me? You Why know, Sam. You know me? how it is. Oh, you use me, you whore. <laughs> 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 All right. We're going to. Right. I would hope. Luke, what is it? Howard. Yeah. It's enough already. The big, the big build up here. Let's hear, hear the tape already. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm stalling, dude. You caught me. <laughs> how bad could it be? And it's not that bad. It's just. He's right. Let's just. Okay. All right. Here we go. Thanks. You got it, Luke. That's right, because if it's not bad now, we've talked to about it so much that people are expecting something really hard. It's not that it's that bad. I just feel odd about it, and that's all I'll say. Okay, here we go. So you want me to get laid? Who cares? I, shut oh, up, John. Douchebag. <laughs> all right, here, here we go. CD1. Constantly. Did you have a real day with Howard? All right. How come it's not queued up? That is it. Oh, that's it? That's how it starts? Yeah. Okay. All right, that's it.
<laughs> what are you worried about? All right, start sort of in the middle. This is Chauncey. Is Chauncey here? He is. If he wants to come in, he can, I guess. It's his interview, but... It's the worst show ever. <laughs> it's so bad. Your show is so bad, Chauncey. Despite... Look at Chauncey. I didn't recognize him. Chauncey, would you go gay? He's wearing leather pants. <laughs> No guy ever looks Didn't straight. Did you hear the list the other day? Dude, no guy looks straight in leather pants, especially you. Yeah, she's so, going to the Stuttering John gym. It's way gay. Sorry. What if you're straight and you wear leather pants? What does that make you? Look at Chauncey's tattoo on his arm. He's got he's got a ribbon on it, but you can see he crossed out the name on the ribbon. Yeah, I did what it myself. Is... You did? How do you do that? Uh, you take table salt and you just keep rubbing it until the ink comes uh, to the surface and you peel the scab off and it takes the uh, ink out. Nice uh, job. Uh, and now it looks beautiful. <laughs> All right. Anyway, here's Chauncey's radio show with Lila who... looks like a gay pirate with that glasses. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go. Chauncey, those leather pants don't fit, by the way. They're so tight, your belly's hanging over them. Yeah, I'm very fat. I'm a fat man. Yeah, and no guy looks straight in leather pants. Yeah, but if I am straight, what does that make me? I don't know, but it just don't look right. Are you wearing underwear? No. Yeah. <laughs> it makes for false advertising. Yeah, that's gay, dude. Is it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. With, a, with a red goatee? Yeah. Yeah. All right, so here it is. Here's Cha Chauncey's radio show. Seems, 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 his radio show seems to be mostly about me. All right, here we go. All right. I had a date with him, actually. Constantly. Did you have a real date with Helen? Yeah. Really? Uh-huh. Well, I went to his friend's house and, and uh, had dinner. Okay. It wasn't anything start, start frisky. Start talking. Oh, just, you just start talking. I'll shut up. <laughs> really? He asked me out. I was on his show, and he asked me out on a date. Oh. Really? Oh. <laughs> See? Boom. See, right away, that's the yeah. Montel on, Williams move. Well, I told guest. you, I look like a tool. Oh. And you know what happened. Oh. How did you ask her out, Howard? I, mean, did you I say, didn't. No, but did you say come over? She called me up and said, you know, I, I said to her, I saw the rough cut of Son of the Beach. She's an actress who works on the show. She goes, God, I'd love to see it. I said, so come on over and watch. Didn't ask her out. By the way, I did that's the same the thing taste. with a lot of people. <laughs> yes, there is. That's a tape. So if a girl comes over, that's the date. Oh. That's what I'm taking. I don't even want to interrupt this. Here you go. <laughs> Unless you guys have a question. Because, you know, he's like, Lila, I want to bang you. And I was all, well. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! I told you, I look like a total tool. You know what, Howard? What happened? Date rape. That day she was on the air, and you said you would bang her on the air. You know what I mean? You were doing a bit like, oh, you're hot, and... Then I guess you guys get together not too long after that. Maybe. But you see how she's making me sound? Yeah. She's not saying, oh, on the air we were kidding around. It was right. just like, you know, like, we... I want to bang... It sounds like she... in a phone call. Right. You she say, feels... come on over here, girl. I want to bang you. Right. This is a date to her. She feels it's a date. Okay. <laughs> you know, that's interesting, but you're my boss, so I really can't. Yeah, now she now She's she the can. one who's backing yeah. off. Right. It's like you guys work at the food mart and you're, you know, the manager. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah, she it's the same bang, thing. She can't bang you. Yeah, she's boss. a sixteen-year-old at the food mart, and I'm the I'm the forty-seven-year-old manager who's gonna bang her. I'm Joey Butterfuco all of a yeah, sudden. Yeah, she's trying to work her way up to fries, not that way. Right. <laughs> who's on the phone? Copperfield? Is that the real guy? Yeah, yeah. Because I gave him the number. Oh. I gave his manager the number. Told him to call. Oh, oh, oh wait, we'll get right back. Let me just let me just talk to Copperfield. And co let me just congratulate him. All right. Let me just two seconds. I and swear to God. Uh, he went. He, he hung up. <laughs> he disappeared. All right, let's get back to the tape. David Schmavid, you guys want to hear the tape, and I know it. All right, let's see. Here we go. Okay, okay. Well, how about you have a dinner with me? So I had dinner. We, I went to his house. He's got a beautiful... What is, this house? what is his apartment like? I can't even imagine. His... Someone from IBM wired his house. I'm not kidding. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, he's got a 12 by 12 foot wall of just electronic constant. Really? Things that control... Yeah, I'm freaking Batman. <laughs> you know, she can't get the words out. You do have an impressive electronics set. Yeah, but, but who needs to talk about no, that? No, you're right. I'll talk you know, about yeah. that. Well, I'm not going to say it. Go on. I look like a tool, okay? It's, it's all about, you it's know, like the about. bachelor pad. Oh you know, this yeah. is the, the seduction. The seduction. Is I got her in my looking lair. Looking at my right. toys. Hold on a second. David, what happened? Hi, I'm a, I walked over to the bed and uh, and, yeah. and, fell. and you saw your girlfriend's breasts and you went insane. <laughs> You know exactly. You're a mind reader. Let me ask you something. Did you watch your own special last night? Well, I was preparing his live, so I, I prepared. Right, right. I was okay. in this thing, so. Yeah. Where was she? Did she sit in the audience and watch him? Yeah, she, do was, his she magic? was there. Her of course. Dad. <laughs> her, her dad. Her no, 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 no. Dad? My dad and her. Oh. Yeah. Well, yeah. Her dad you want to make disappear. <laughs> yes, her dad. Her dad's pretty cool, actually. All right, hey, David, I just wanted to compliment you, that's all. I, I really do appreciate it. You're a good guy. Thank you for coming yeah. in. Yeah. Come in any time you want. Yeah, thanks, man. Thanks. Later. The, guy, the guy's awesome. One of the best television shows I ever saw. That's how good it was. Watch it.
Vinny, you had nothing to do with it. Stop sitting there <laughs> smiling like it's Vinny, yours. You tool. <laughs> right, let's go back to my humiliation. <laughs> yeah, let's go back to the other tool. Yeah. There's a whole house. LCD Lordy. screens in every room that make the shades go up and down. And keep going oh, oh, you, know, you, know what, you, know, you know who she's making you sound like? Yeah. Do you remember that movie with Goldie Hawn when Dudley Moore had the bachelor pad where right. the bed came out of the yeah. wall? Yeah, and, and you the know curtains what? Closed. Austin Powers. Your Austin no, Powers. Yeah, Austin Powers. Yeah, and you know, I'm thinking about some schmo I met on Long Island who does the same thing. I know, and I'm thinking about some schmo I met in L.A. who does the same thing. And I'm just, it makes me look like a tool. I know it, okay? So you want to stop the tape now? No, 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 no. no, no. Shall we shag now or shall we shag now? <laughs> It's like it's like it's, it's a bachelor pad. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's yeah, a super yeah, bachelor pad. Super bachelor super pad. pad. Really? Oh my god. Did you get to see his bedroom? Yeah. Oh yeah. Baby. Tell me. You, you start talking, girl. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what is his bed like? Oh, Describe his bed. He's got a huge. I think it's a California king. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, he's does he have the, does he have the, the, yeah, he's does he have the, the like the tiger like you know <laughs> quilt or? The huge no, he's... I got rid of that. Uh, very, uh, uh, very, uh, just in time. Does the bed go in circles? The room spins. It it <laughs> vibrates and bounces, but it's, I think it's on hydraulics. If you're tired, right. you need a little help. <laughs> now, how how does it happen where you see his bedroom? At what point does he say to you? <laughs> let me show. You, he says, "Let me show you the apartment." Yeah, let me show you the apartment. And Take it Every room of the apartment right. shows me the, the kids' wing of the house and, and the kids guest wing. rooms, oh, you know, blah, blah, blah. blah. And where did we end up? <laughs> What's the, is, is the bedroom <laughs> the last room? Is oh. it the last room? Hello. Oh. Oh. See what I mean? Oh. And it was so... Oh was it, see, she's just trying to make it into something it yeah. isn't. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. telling you. So I, I, I look like a load. Well, was it the last room? Why did no. you show her the bedroom list? Yeah, I didn't. That's the point. In fact, she saw how the do bedroom. You know? how, do you remember? I re first of all, I know how I show my apartment because we went to my kid's room last. I, I know exactly yeah, what I did. Baby. And second and, and thirdly and thirdly Then it is it really horrible because she's fabricating the Yes. Moment. And thirdly, we spent the time in my living room. Sitting at opposite ends of the couch. No, no. Oh, she said. That's not what she said. What did she say? Okay, so let's hear what she said. Yeah. You know, I'll, I'll tell you exactly what happened. I'm trying to figure out, like, just thinking like a guy. You show her the kids' rooms last, and I can't figure out if you're so disinterested in her or if that's a cool move to show you're a sensitive guy. It wasn't guy. a move. It was like I was just. I knew. <laughs> listen, I knew if Wait I a made minute. a move on her, it would have complicated my life. To Here are my thoughts. Yeah. I think that she's she expects to be hit on. Yes, she does. And so anytime a guy does anything to nice. maneuver himself into a, a situation where they're alone, she assumes she's being hit on. And not, absolutely right. And not only that, her manager called during this whole thing, and he says, you're not hitting on my girl, are you? See? And I so was like, no. Whole, she expects to be but hit on. But wait yeah. a second, Howard. You're alone with this beautiful, stunning woman. Understood. Well, why would you, You're a guy. You have a penis. Of yeah. course, you're single now. Number one. She works for me. And if I have, if I had, let's say I had an affair with right. her. First of all, I'm not putting Lila down. She's gorgeous. Right. But, you know, I'm seeing somebody and I didn't even. You, were you seeing them at that time? I might have been. Oh. Why I'm was not she in sure the apartment? Why have her at the apartment? Because here's what happened. We were hanging out and she said, hey, I, you know, I said, hey, I got this Son of the Beach tape. And she goes, how's it look? I go, Did it's Vinny's great. not buying it. Did you have dinner? Yeah, yeah I, I, I eat dinner every night at 5 o'clock. Whoever's there eats with me. Can I tell you something? <laughs> I, 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 would, not buying. I would go back to the tape. Of the you don't day. have to buy it. This old, no, I'm just saying. Because I look like is, a tool. This is how it's playing out there to the rest <laughs> right. of the country. Right. I was You're with you life. before the tape, and now you lost yeah. me. Yeah, and, and this all came about from the look, day. If Lila, if Lila said to me, listen, See, I'm not buying I either. have to take my clothes <laughs> off and make love to you, yeah. sure I'd do it. I mean, who wouldn't? I'm, well, then I'm, then I'm passively hitting on her. Yeah, see, I think so, too, because I remember the day that she was on the show is where this whole thing started, right, Howard? Uh, and I remember you sort of digging her and sort of... Yeah, but you know what? I've done, in all seriousness, off the air, we talk on the phone quite often. Well, you I've do now, but you had at the time. A few times. I've gotten to Lila. No, I have. I've, I've gotten together with Lila before then. And she, she, she talked about her boyfriend. I talked about what I was into, and the whole thing was. Yeah, but we when were a girl's friends. bringing up yeah. the boyfriend, it's to because she thinks, right. you know, babe, wait a minute, back off She's here. Blocking. I want you to you know make what? sure yeah. you know. Yes. I'm taking. Fine. And and I was, I'm just saying, in her mind, you want her. And I was happy because she was talking about the boyfriend. And I just said to her, listen. I'm not looking for anything. You, you know, we are friends, and that's that. When you're new, it sounds like you're newly single. That you're not. Good. I wasn't that newly single. It sounds like you're, you're a rookie. You're, you're still just, you're learning single. how to date again. It sounds like an awkward nah. guy. I, okay, that's again. what it sounds. That's why I didn't want to play because I sound like a tool, <laughs> and I'm not that much of a tool. But hey, what am I going to do? Deny it? But if you took her clothes off, you would have went for it. 
Yes. Hey, who would not bang Lila? Well, that's well. She. Why would I she mean, I couldn't her? resist her. Yeah, and her manager yeah. at the house. Why just her? Why not? She could have brought her manager. He, in fact, I think he was supposed to come, and then he ended up calling and saying he couldn't come. So, so that's my fault. She's saying you asked her for a date. Not only yeah, that, in all like fairness, I don't even know her manager, and I don't want some strange dude up in my apartment. I so knew Lila. You only wanted Lila. I've, if you came or someone I knew, I would have been fine with it. I think. Mm. It's the truth. All right, here we go. This is sick. I told you I'm going to sound like a load anyway, so here it is. So fine, I'm a tool. Well, this is my... And what are you thinking at that point? Are you wondering, is he going to slam me on the bed? Like, what's going to happen? You don't know. No, you know, Howard would never, ever do that. Well, what... Because I told her I wouldn't. Back of your mind, you're not thinking that? Not at all. No. What did you think? I just thought... Or, we or does he have to worry about you? Were you going to slam him on the bed? I was about to dive at his ankles, and you know, <laughs> knock him onto the bed. So, so he shows you the bed. And then is that an awkward moment? Is it an awkward moment when he's shown you the, the bedroom? No, it was not awkward at all. There's a point where you go, well, this is, what do we do now? Like, it was, it, just leave the bedroom? or? No, I just, you know, we took the tour of the house. Yeah. And I saw he's got a fabulous kitchen, and his, 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 his like... I noticed her story changed. So the bedroom then took the tour of the house. See? Oh, listen to you, Perry. Uh, exactly. laid out. Really? Laid out. Oh, I now, is that attractive? Let me ask, be, and be uh, please, as honest as you can be. As honest as you can be. Yes, when you, when, you, when, you're, when you see a man that owns something like that, owns a house like that, an apartment, <laughs> and, and you're a young, attractive girl, and he's single, come on, is that... Is that in the back of your head, you're saying... Uh, does that turn you on? Please, please. The power. The power. The money. The power. He's a funny He's a funny man. He's a powerful man. Well, he's looks. a rich man. No, what about how I look? I look yeah. like a bunch of yeah. Handsome she man. She can overlook how I look. Is that sexy? Of course. So you, you're turned on by it? I mean, yeah, money, power. Sure. That's sexy. That's sexy. Mm -hmm. Ah, she was coming on. The opposite of that. <laughs> the exact opposite. If you saw my apartment, I mean, you know, who wants to like, you know? But that that's, is that's, it. That's, that's, that's not that end all. Oh, oh, it is. Again, what about the guy's face? Well, again, people who look like you would stand all and be all. No, that's yes, not. Oh, think about so it. If you're if you're caught up with someone else's money and power, then where does that yeah. leave? Believe me, after the show, after the show, if I said, "Hey, you want to go on a date?" It's not going to be the same response. So you're cracking yourself up. I think I'm very funny. I know nobody else. Does. I know you laugh at yourself. I know this is the worst radio show, but yeah. I'm learning. I'm learning how to do okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you're my mentor. <laughs> Listen to me. Uh, I got so many you know questions. why Chauncey's laughing? Because he is hitting on her. Right. <laughs> it's now like a and she's so, not picking so it up. How, did the date how go? you win them over? It's, right. a, it's actually a trick. Yeah, you're winning every with go? those leather pants. Right. How did the date go? Was a question. Okay. But the date was great. I, I walked. I came into his. Because this is not public. It was all in the house. Because he's want to be. He want pictures taken. Yeah, so you can't. Bothered. You can't go to a restaurant. It has to be done in the house. Yeah. So Nobu Sushi delivered a meal for like four people, and we ate almost all of it. It was great. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> it was interesting getting going getting there though, because the downstairs of the door, he has to give. He has a fake name. Does he really? Oh, yeah. Thanks for giving out everything. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Even, even, I gotta tell you, even see that pissed me off. Even, that's what was making me wrong. mad. Well, you know what? Even the whole why doesn't she give those details about the guy she's seeing? Oh, she won't even because she won't even give you his name. Talk that's about that's it. what pissed me off. She can get right into his house. Yeah. You know how you know you brought in the best food. Exactly. Right. You know, you know, yeah. 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 Well, who do you do that for? Exactly. Yeah. Like, just like, some friends. It sounds like a guy. When I was over his apartment. It sounds like a guy. Break Howard. It sounds like a guy. I know. To, I saw. I saw. Why wouldn't I be mad at her? It it sounds sounds like, so, then let's and let's let's put it this way. Let's say I was hitting on her. Okay, and I'm claiming I'm not, but okay, whatever. Let's say I was hitting on her. Don't hit how come on she's, me. Yeah. How come she's quiet about everything else? But with me, she's busy blabbing to Chauncey well, everything I do. Because people care about you. They don't care about the guy. Oh, you say do. Give me some credit. I'm a good interviewer, Howard. Oh, no, come on, no, Chauncey. Stop, I Chauncey. No credit. The Howard, only stop. time, the only time that you are a good interviewer is when you talk about me. Hey, Howard. Yeah. Would you guys drink wine or anything? No. Come on. So, I'm till. Okay, I'm All lying right. to you. Right. No, we did not drink wine. But you know what it's, it's, John knows you don't go to Nobu for just no, some girl. No, you got no, the best restaurant and ordered way too much food. <laughs> I, I have Nobu like. all the time. No, but it, but I'm saying it to the I listener. I eat it all the time. It fine. sounds like right. you I know what it sounds like. Understand. This is a girl who came to your apartment. And said, oh, he pulled out the no boo. Yeah, right, and right, she's right. By the money and the fame. Robin, Robin. So I feel like a total tool. He had no boo delivered. Yeah. That's, that's right. That's what because I'm you don't want to be from way far away. He's like, oh, I was, do it all the time. If it was innocent, you would have been at no boo. But again, it again, it's not like no boo's around the corner. They had a truck it yeah, all the way up. I eat no boo whether she's there or not. But she doesn't know she that. She doesn't know that. I know. So to her, but he's saying if, it, but Chauncey's saying if it was innocent. You would have. Uh, you would have gone out to a restaurant. You would right. and came back and watched the right the show. Yeah.
I know. The only but you want to know something? I didn't want to go to a restaurant. Because it would look bad. Like Wrong. you're dating your co-star and there's something... Well, some of that too, but yeah. also because I eat dinner around 5 o'clock. I'm in bed by 8 o'clock. Ask, ask her. She came over to eat dinner. We watched us under the beach and then... I said good night. You got to leave. I got to go to bed. Did you drink any alcohol? No. Did you kiss her on the cheek? How'd you no. say good night? No. Just say goodbye. Shook her hand. Shook her hand. Doesn't no. Make we any just sense. say goodbye. Doesn't like you'd like say to a friend. Did goodbye. Did sex ever go through your mind while no. you were sitting there? Come on. Gay. That's insane. I don't believe that. Come on. Yeah, come I knew it was going to happen. And you're single. That's it did not, not happen. Having it go, not having it go through your head. Yeah. That's gay. But that's I told gay. you that's, that yeah. that's why I got so mad at her for this interview because it makes me look like a tool. Chris, you're on the air. Hi. Howard. Yeah. Hey, Chris. Hey, I know she's a beautiful girl, but she sold you out, man. Absolutely. You got, she you definitely get rid of her. did. She I'm definitely done. did. She definitely you got, you sold got me out. Hold, hold some new auditions, find somebody else who's... She's using nah. you to promote herself. I now, wouldn't I'm fire kidding. somebody for that because then I'd and, look like more of a tool. And you know what the problem is, Howard? Yeah. Howard, Howard you and know now what? if I wanted a fire, I couldn't. If you know why I know this is great? Because if somebody was telling us this story about Sylvester Stallone, right. we would be all over it. It is. It's great. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and I'll tell you where else you lose, so, I, so when I heard it, when Chauncey gave it to me, I said, damn, I look like a real tool. Hey, and, and Lila definitely sold me out. But, I agree with Chris. Oh, here's, where you, here's where you yeah. lose. Yeah. You lose. Sold you out, man. She, yep. she, did, she let you out there hanging. Absolutely. And, you know, that was if, it. If you're hey, Robin, good, good morning, Robin. You're beautiful. I love you. Right. Absolutely, Robin. You're Howard. beautiful. Yes, go ahead, Fat Tony. He never got hey, the no for me. Yeah. Let me you need to be pissed off at Chauncey. Chauncey's the one who broke the male code of honor. Uh, Chauncey's a girl. He's wearing leather pants. Yeah, he's a female. He you broke the male code of honor. No, Howard, you do the same thing on the show here. We broke the code. out, but... Still, Chauncey broke the mail. Howard's code broken the code. It's different when Howard times. does it. It's different when Howard does it. Never do it to you, Chauncey. I never do that to you, Chauncey. <laughs> it's no code. I never ask the slobs you go out with what happens. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Chauncey's married. Don't, don't wear your panties, Chauncey, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Sold me out. Hey, Howard. Yeah. Your friend. Uh, yeah. Did you say No, I don't blame Chauncey. I do blame Lila because Lila could just He's say, hey. He's got to ask the question. I got to ask the question. Right. It's an interview. Understood. Did you sit her down on the couch and press the button and have the screen come down? Yeah, of course. <laughs> well, that's the only way to get it. How down. am I going to watch TV? <laughs> it's Austin Powers. But see, here's, where you come across, here's where you come across bad. Uh, right. If you're telling the truth, she sold you out. And if you're lying, she still sold you out. You know what I mean? And exactly. You can't, you can't there win. There is no my not point. telling you out. Right. And playing this only makes her happier because she gets more attention. But I'll play it because it's good radio. Because people know where he lives, and he's yeah, 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 he crazy things happen. Yeah. So he's got a fake name. She goes, people know where he lives, so he has so a fake name. So let me tell everybody so me, how to get to it. So let me tell your radio show audience how how to you know how to get in. Uh, I'm really pissed because I don't know that name. And I'll tell you, I pulled back a little bit. I don't think I was as aggressive as I could have nah, been. You, 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 you know, you're you're a fluff. You're a Barbara Walters, isn't it? Yeah, but not. But she's he's getting an awful lot of information without asking a question. Yeah, in other words, that's, that's, that's the thing. You're yeah. not even pushing. I'm not even pushing. In fact, that's if right. you didn't interrupt so much, you would have gotten more. I know that's it. Right. I know it. Yeah. It's true. You got nervous. She was blabbing so much, didn't you? <laughs> I did. Yeah. Is Mr. So and So available? Or I'm going to visit him. They're like, oh, on your name. Uh, this whole time, I'm feeling like. Nah, so so I have now a... she's thinking, mm. yeah, this is the trick he does with all his right. girls. Yeah. They have to come up and say this name, and I'm getting the eye See? from the people downstairs. Exactly. I sound like a tool again. Yeah. She's going, mm -hmm. uh, guess, guess what he set up for me? <laughs> <laughs> he had his doorman say, give a different name. <laughs> right. no, like, like, I don't you're have so, problems. You're so oh. important. Yeah, I'm so important. I have a different but, but, name. But right. Take a step back. Right. Robert's right. Take a step back. Yeah. She has to say a special name to get in. Right. You ordered Nobu. Right. Um, the screen comes down. Looks the house bad. is way too big. You right. show her the bedroom. Right. Right. I mean, it's I look like a tool. It's a seduction. You're right. Howard Hughes. I look like a tool. <laughs> hey, Howard, how was the lighting? With the jet? Did, 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 did you turn the oh, lights he always low? has the perfect light. Yeah, they did the lights. <laughs> are, there, are there different levels of lighting? <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's dimmers in your house. Yeah. Yes, sir. So 10 well, is the he highest. I already told you everything works by the I was screen. on a two, man. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see how great she was when you watched the tape? Were you praising her work? Uh, I praised everyone. Howard, it wouldn't be embarrassing if you just admit you were trying to get laid. No. Ah, no, wait a second. I'll over. admit I was trying to get Fine. I was trying to get laid. Oh, the, right. the embarrassing part is she went on the Chauncey yeah. Hayden show and gave all the details. That's whether true. you don't, It's irrelevant whether I was trying. If I sit here now and deny that I was trying to get laid, it looks like a guy trying to get laid. Yeah. But Are you know, there I know women it. who come on to you that you say, you know, I really would rather not get involved. But yeah. you don't come and blow their cover. No, not at all. No, you know what the deal is? Howard I've, turned down, I've turned down women since you, I'm single. But Howard doesn't want to be on the Ron Zimmerman list of guys who have to work way too hard to get laid. And right. Howard, and, and is that that, right, that, that right. ethical thing about Exactly. Well, that's the whole thing. She, she He's got a show. 
show so he could date women. Right. right. I'm a very right. self-conscious guy. It's embarrassing. And it's embarrassing. Yeah. To, to, like He's I'm dating the people he employs. Mm. Howard, you've turned down women that look as good as she does. And you know what? It's a great career yeah. move for Howard. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I have. Who? Oh. Please, there's I don't want to say. I think models all over the city. I have. Who would love to be with him? Howard, it's a great career move because now she's locked in. You can't fire her. You can't give her less lines because now you look worse. That's right. If anything, she helped the career by That's doing right. this. That's now right. you're stuck. That's right. Like, oh, my God, they probably think I'm going to go upstairs and just bang him because of... <laughs> yeah, you, they don't know. They don't. Right away, the doorman... Her mind is she's on, thinking, I'm not getting banged right. by this guy. That's she had it more on her mind than I did. And she gets hit on so much, in her mind, she's going, oh, the doormen are all discussing me now. I'm I another know. one of the million. Yeah, but you know that's what? exactly what I said. She's used to this happening. That's exactly why I wouldn't bang her. <laughs> I, enjoy, I enjoy not banging the girls who think that I'm always going to bang them. I'm a warped individual. <laughs> I'll put you in a situation. See, and you'll most bang guys it. just bang no, all you the won't. women. <laughs> how about how about I've been in a situation? Chick in my apartment, we're alone. She says to me, "I want to take off my clothes now. I don't want to have sex with you." And I said, "You don't have to believe it. I've done no it, way. and I guarantee it's a girl." We that... can't find that girl. No, no, but you can. Oh, but the difference is, you got to put it. Up. Stop being so serious. Because I would rather. <laughs> Because the chick thought I was gonna bang her. No. That's just because she had of you. That's right. She Jamie had you. Is that Jamie? Bergman? No, <laughs> not Jamie Bergman at all. Yeah, it's all the people on the show. No, it's not. Nobody from the show. <laughs> See, but that's exactly it. Every woman you hire now. Yeah. So that's it. No more bringing people but to the Howard, have you I ever, learned my lesson. Have you ever, since your divorce, have you ever made the first move or do girls usually, you know, hit on you? Of course I made the first move. Okay. Of course. Because uh, I'm just trying to say, if Lila had made the first move, then Howard would have banged. I don't sure, know. What, you know, would, I, I probably would have. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. He you didn't have want to make the first move. And are there rules? Are there rules to dating Howard Stern? There has to be. No, Did shut up. There rules? The rules? Let me hear the rest of the interview. Yeah, because I want to yeah. hear them. <laughs> yeah, because I do too. <laughs> Rule is, if you have a vagina, I'm interested. Uh, <laughs> I mean, so maybe for tonight. Yeah, yeah. I'm, the, I'm the thing of you're, the flavor of the night. That's interesting. So you're thinking that. Oh, of course. So I, I had a okay. turtleneck sweater on. <laughs> he made a comment about that, too. He's like, I knew nothing was happening. You came in with the, with the outfit on that said it all. <laughs> but I, but I like the psychology behind it. <laughs> and I don't think Nobu delivers for anyone, by the way. I don't think you can call Nobu and get some delivery. Him and Robert De Niro, and I think that would be about it, probably. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so you have... You have sushi. Sushi. Had sushi. And then what happened? Watched an episode of Sun on the Beach that was, yeah. um, they were in editing on it, so I got yeah. to see it before everyone else. <laughs> oh. Now, are you sitting on a couch together watching it? Yes, we were sitting are on a couch. Are you cozy? Are you, does he have his arm around you? Chauncey. No. Oh, I'm dying. Chauncey, you scumbag. Oh, but let's hear the answer. It's not sounding, it's not sounding bad enough. Is yeah, it? yeah, let's hear the answer. <laughs> no. I mean, was there a second date? Um... I don't think I'm supposed to comment on that. Oh. Oh. That's even worse. That's a yes. That's a yes. Oh, well. There was no second date. Oh, oh, well. Day. oh, oh well. well. Who, who told her not? Why would she not comment on that? that Let's means, put her on the air. That's a yes. She commented on everything else. Why hold that back? No oh, second date. Well. Sounds like you banged on the yeah, second date. No. So you were trying to seduce her. Since she came to my apartment, to Lila and I have gotten together since then. And we never, we never touched each other. We never did anything. Why even a comment about what she's wearing when she comes in? That no. Alone. You know where we commented? On the air the next day. I said Lila came over and she was wearing a turtleneck. Yeah, That's but all. you also, she says, she says you interview. said, yeah. I knew nothing never. was going on because the outfit said it all. Never said that. Never said that to her. I'm just telling you what I That's heard. Right, right. It means like. you wanted it. She told you right. no right up front. That, yeah. right. So now you know no. why I was embarrassed by this. Oh, uh, what? The what? Leave them guessing. Really? That's our girl. Really? <laughs> That's um, Mayor Massing. Mayor Massing, yeah. What is it, uh, Trace? Yeah? Go ahead. You're on the air. Oh, Howard. King of all tools. Yeah, see, <laughs> there you go. Howard, are you, what are you? Are you crazy? Don't you know better than to bring a bring a black girl up to your apartment? She might steal something. Uh, <laughs> Howard, you should take a lie detector test. You gotta okay. watch out for these. I will. <laughs> I will take one. Are you gonna fire her now? Can't. No, no, nah, I wouldn't fire over. I just was hurt. She got you for life. I was just kind of embarrassed. That's all. And what what we really want to know now is when are we gonna hear the details of your new girlfriend, Mrs. X? Mrs. X. Yes. <laughs> Wouldn't that be Miss X? I wouldn't say. I wouldn't She's on my show next week, by the way. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> oh, oh. We want to know all about Miss X. <laughs> She's on the cover of Stepping Out magazine next yeah, week. Great. <laughs> yeah, great. Yeah, when's Chauncey going to interview her? Seeing a nice girl, that's all. All right, we, well, we want to know. know. We want to know. know everything. What do you want to know? We 
you want to know names? You want to know picks? You want the name pictures? I've said on the air a couple of times already. Have you I have? Robin? Yeah, that's right. She's very nice. Very nice girl. Very nice girl. She's a ten. That's all you need to know. That's it. Bring her on the show to replace Jackie. <laughs> it's true. Well, there's another move you haven't made let, yet. Let me tell you something. You put her on the TV show, the ratings will go up. Right. But we, we uh, knew somebody who used to hire his right. girlfriend oh, who's to work oh, with him. Oh, yeah, okay. oh, don't talk about that. <laughs> Howard. Uh, uh, Howard. Uh, she's trying to have a private life. <laughs> that would be sad. You yeah. know what? That would be sad right. if you just hired her here. It would be sad. Right, right. Because it was sad. Yeah. Howard, I'm out here in Hollywood, and I know girls who are actresses, and they've told me stories about six-year-old producers that bring them... These girls go to their house right. and the same Steve exact Seagal. story. Right, I know. And that's why that's it's, why I it's the story we're hearing. That's why I feel that's why I feel like a tool. <laughs> I'm being honest. I didn't I, I didn't like it because it made it look like something it wasn't, but how am I ever gonna deny that it, you, know, you know you sound better if you I sound like an they, idiot saying that uh, nothing was gonna I, happen. I thought you were overreacting when you didn't want to play this, but the truth is yeah, so it's, bad. Bad. it's bad and there's no way for you to look good right. really, no matter what. When right. I said sh to to Chauncey to send me the tape, I knew it wasn't this hey, bad. <laughs> Not only that when you told Chauncey to get the tape, yeah. we confiscated it at the door, and I took it home. <laughs> yeah, you should. You should be very angry. I really resent that. You should. Hey, Howard. I don't blame you. I'd be mad, too. Yeah. Are there women that have the same story and did get laid? Um, what, say that again? In other words, is there a girl out there who you did give the tour to, did show the bedroom list? They give no boo. And then did... I don't think so. Did the coach to get in? No. Oh, come on. I don't think so, no. How did they get there, then? I mean, I, I'm trying to think everybody I've gone out with. You ha you do this with everybody who comes to your apartment. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I kind of Howard's I've apartment with Universal Studios. <laughs> I have a Howard's Blum giving tours dinner. every hour. Yeah, right. <laughs> if it's a bad day, Howard, do you change the code at the front door? If it's a bad day, do you change the code? This no, no, no. Is there what any chance, any chance at all? I'm getting hammered. Lila, it's a girl code. Lila works I'm getting here. hammered on my own show. <laughs> Lila, hold on. Yeah. It yeah. must be a girl code. Oh. Lila That's works for you. You have the regular code and the girl code. Lila works for you. Is right. there any chance, because Lila would never, you know, do this because she works for you, mm. is there any chance that I'm going to pick up the Inquirer and hear the same story by another woman? Yes. No, well, not the exact. I mean, I've had people over and had dinner. Yeah, sure. By the yeah, way. Yeah, you could hear that. Are the dinner? doormen on retainer? <laughs> My doormen are pretty cool guys. I mean. Uh, I mean, they know not to let any... You got to run out of You know, like, age. they don't give girls the signal that they're not the only girl. No, I don't know. Hey, I, hey, Howard, I, I don't know what they do. You know, I gave up a long does time ago. Is her own special name, Howard, or is it like... No, no, no. I mean, come any, on, dude. Any woman you're, you're, you're killing me. You're killing me. Well, all I'm saying on that? is, I don't know the code. Yeah. How would yes, you do? Can you're I just not? say this? You know the name to give at the you door know, to get in. You know, oh Robin, God, you know why you don't know the code? You don't put out. <laughs> you absolutely do. You've been over to my place. I have no idea how to get to you. Get out of here. Ralph, you're on the air. You, Howard, please. Stop it. Painful. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I'll turn it off. It really is. It is. Fine, I told you it makes me sound like a tool. Can I ask you a question? And I didn't want to play it, but I did because it was good radio, you're, so give me that much. You're digging a hole oh, I hear you. I understand. Right. What? Well, are you going to ask her or anybody else in the show out again? I'm seeing somebody. But I think, you know, if, if I wasn't, I'm sure I, mean, I would ask someone out. But I didn't ask Lila out. I mean, it's just no, so silly. No, he meant from the are show. Are you exclusive, Howard? Are no. you seeing somebody exclusively? Well, yeah, yeah, I kind of am. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. By the way, any, any woman who's dated uh, yes Howard Stern, no yes, the answer is yes. <laughs> can, can I send out an open call to any woman who's dated Howard Stern to come on my? Oh, e oh, 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 oh you oh. son of a bitch! How dare you! At, oh. at one point, I was on your side. Oh, I'm just joking. No, I'm joking. I'm a friend. <laughs> no, I don't think any any other woman that I've seen would do this. I honestly don't. Hey, okay, it's rare. It's rare. I really don't. don't. How many are there? I don't know who you've seen. So no, I know who I've seen. Why did you do this? But you don't. You didn't know this would happen, Howard. You know that showing that apartment is a turn on to women, right? Fine. I, that's a turn on if, to if, that turn, if that's what turns a woman on, then so be it. He How, certainly didn't decorate it so they wouldn't be turned on. Let me just say this on behalf, a, on behalf of one of your co-stars. Who was the other woman that was in the studio <laughs> that day? Jamie Bergman? No, the, the um, woman who plays the... Mayor uh, Messinger. She, she, during that whole interview, she was shaking her head no, like this, saying... Don't do don't it. Do don't it. do it. Don't do it. So uh, she knew better. Time, she was like this. She gets to stay She's there. right. Yeah. But, she, but she's, she's a pro. She's a she pro. She knows she hasn't seen the apartment. No. I'm getting her up there the next. You know that? <laughs> what? The matter that you look like a tool, you act like a tool, you're still the king, you know? Thanks, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to feel my way in the world like the rest of us. I think John's point is well taken, yeah. though. Yeah. And even though you're telling the truth, I think that if you came on the air and said you were trying to bang her, we'd all respect you because 
You should be trying to get. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like we don't be like. Hey, we've both been there. Nothing wrong. The guy. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what's wrong with it. The guy in that interview, the way she's described it, makes it sound like a desperate, hard up guy. It does. It does. We've all been there. Yeah. No, wait a but second. Every that? guy yeah, is that wrong. Guy. Yeah, why and that? I'm telling you. You got a guy in the world who hasn't done something. I am. I am. I have done stuff to get laid, but I didn't do it with Lila. I That's all. I, but but you see, it's I could deny it all I want. I am it sounds going hollow. to object. Yeah. Go ahead. Because Lila is in the realm of girls. Yes. Okay. Right. And you do everything in your life to get girls. Right. Okay. So you, you could did stuff to get Lila. She wouldn't yeah. be That's there you know what? I'm not going to argue with you <laughs> because <laughs> it's you know what? It's useless. This is a, this is a revenge for the Jackson Pollock. No, it's fine. <laughs> Go for it. Go for it. Rip me to shreds. Mark and I we're buddies. He's Are you? Cool. Yeah. Yeah. He's about. my friend. I can only have him with his friend. Like that really? together, so. It's fun. We've got a nice friendship. I know. I got, I got enough. <laughs> Chauncey's like, I'm done. Chauncey's satisfied. Yeah, right. I've ruined the life. <laughs> you've, you've said enough. Satisfied. I'm happy. I'm satisfied with that. Did you feel like you were grilled? No, no. Really? I've been asked all this night. Really. Grilled? You didn't have no. to. She just you opened right her. up. She's ready you to said spill. hello. She's ready to spill her guts about my it's personal life. She interviewed you. Yes. <laughs> Dude, you were trying to stop? You're trying to wrap yeah, it up. I was trying to stop. <laughs> I know. I, I felt like, whoa. Right. It was you, painful. You, it was painful you, to listen to. I'm not done yet. You were probably ready to go on, but she kept... <laughs> yeah, you called me the next morning on his show and asked, what happened? Okay. It's 6 in the morning and they're calling me. I'm trying to get them. Oh, my Lord. Well... Anyway, uh, we have to take a break, so I should say yeah. goodbye. That's the highlight of well, yeah. you know, Howard. it's the highlight of Lila's She's life. The thing, that, the thing that comes across <laughs> funny about this is how many. What did you say, Ron? She's a pretty girl. That's all. <laughs> Ch 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 how many people were you interviewing with her? Just the two. Yeah, because the other person doesn't seem to be being interviewed at all. Yeah, well, yeah. Have no. you called your agent and told your agent to tell her to you know, clam up? No, no, not at all. We she talked to her on the phone. She could. She could. Do whatever she wants. She, you know, she. I'm has, not going to. She doesn't get it though. I have to tell you because she paged me the other night. and I Called her back and she goes. I heard Howard's mad. Is he mad at me? But I'm not the person to say he is or isn't. I said, well, you know, he was talking on the but, air. But you know what kills me about her? She's, she's so defensive. When you ask her a question about her personal life on this show, yeah. you ask her who she's seeing. I can't say. I can't say. And I know she was. You know, I know who she dates. Right. And the thing is, is like, uh, hey, you know, come on out and say it. I'm not going to out you, but say it. No, I can't say. And then, and then she's on some internet show going. Uh, well, here's what I can say. By the way, can I plug my show? Yeah. You mind? No, we don't. You know what? Why? I prefer you, you did it. I could be worse. Hey, I could have been worse. Howard. I backed off on it. I deserve. All right, just plug your stupid show. No one can yeah. listen to they it anyway. Actually, I'm, I'm supposed to be on the air right now at nine o'clock. Uh, yeah. That's some. That's some station. Hey, Howard, honestly, w dot com. The okay. Chauncey Hayden Show. Thank what is it? Honestly, did, did you get aroused at all the whole time she was over? No. Put me up to a lie detector. No, no, I don't doubt that. He, he I'm a doesn't homo. walk around doing things like that. Yeah, I'm not what Gary. Do you, how, how do you control it? <laughs> Howard. Dude, I have control. He's an adult. Howard. I'm 47. He's you know, not again, near gorilla. Howard, like again, you. step back from this interview. <laughs> step out of your body. No. Sit over here. And, I know. And watch I'm it. not denying it. Just, I'm not going to try and well, deny it. I explained hey, it. Hey, we hey, heard let's, that. Yeah. Ralph, you're on the air. Listen, I, I gotta, you know, people are gonna yell at me, but I gotta defend you a little bit. Thank you. We had, we had a couple conversations because I thought Lila was hot. We had a couple conversations where you had talked to her, and you had definitely said to me she wasn't interested, and this was before you guys hung out. Right. And, I, and what you, did had I, to, you had said to me she's not interested in me. Yeah, and you know what? I told, mean he's not. And I told, you, about it. I told you not to get started with her because she's a user, and look at her. I was yeah, right. Well, Ralph did say that. And in fact, in fact Ralph that. said to me. <laughs> Next one to no one. <laughs> Ralph never sat and talked about me in an interview. Well, shut up, Gary. Why don't you go get another car accident, stupid? <laughs> <laughs> I was Ralph, said to, Ralph, Ralph and I were out one night, and he, was, he saw Lila sitting at a table before he even knew she was on Son of the Beast. She goes, man, she's pretty hot. I go, you want me, you want me to introduce you to her? I was like, you going to introduce Ralph to her. And he was like, nah, 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 if I'm going to hit on her, I'll do it on my own. But, you know, but whatever. Yeah, I'm not going to even try and defend yeah, myself. The point you, you, is, you, this should is... Buy, you should fire her, not because of what she did. Oh, she's a horrible actress. Oh, 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 now you don't have to say that. Son of the Beast is good. Like a, oh, the show is great, but... Sound like a bitter queen. It sounds like yeah. a guy. If you fight it, because like, you didn't get laid, you had to fire her. Because yeah, no, I would never do that. No. I'm so not my that. point is, we're all listening to her characterization. Right. I mean, right. Day. she's at the point now where she's getting paid through the actor strike. And you know and what, you mean? Know what? Yeah. I, re I remember this. I remember this too. And you said, "Well, we just hung out. and We had some food and something." Yeah, we've all you know, done it's like you weren't making a big deal. Yeah, you weren't yeah. like... Yeah, but Ralph, if he got laid, he would have had a different story. Exactly. No, no, he would have told me, like, oh, hey, I got Lila coming over, and, you know, and, like... It's not a big deal to me. The whole rap. Ralph, we're not, it's How not, we're not concerned with what happens personally. We're concerned with what happens publicly. Right. Yeah. Yeah, she screwed me. Yeah. yeah. 
confuser. I still say it's odd. That helps you, 22, 23. I don't even know. That someone, if, if you're in your mid-40s and you have a 22-year-old beautiful girl come over, you're newly divorced. Yeah, I mean, you're saying if she went, she, if all of a sudden she says, I have to go to the bathroom, she comes out in a negligee and jumps on top of me. Yeah, of course. Yeah, okay, you know, who's going to turn yeah, that down? Yeah, but the way she's characterizing it, she didn't have to get into a negligee. Right. How you were the guy right. to the, yeah. right. I, I, It made it seem like I was trying to jump well, around. Well, that's because she's so wrapped up in herself. How could anybody want her over without, you know... Right. That's right, right, right. That's what right. I'm saying is what we're hearing. It's, it's a, she well, it's kind of she true. is saying that Howard's the same as 50 right. million yeah. other guys yeah. who are all trying to but get her up to bad? their part. But why is that well, because thing? I thought I was better than that, and I thought that she you knew that. I, mean, I thought I looked better than right. that anyway. You, she's but obviously I didn't. But you, you treat her the same <laughs> yeah, way yeah. the limo driver treats her, the guy at that's the Starbucks right. treats her, the guy at the door treats her. These are all the people she has to protect herself. She doesn't key into the things that are just normal and stuff. She... She keys into all these highlights. That's what she remembers. Like, I put them there for her. Yeah, like everything. But that's how I live. Her. Even but, when but she's not there, that's how I live. But she, in her mind, she thinks I put the right, doorman there. there. When I said, yeah. she said you ordered a Nobu, that meant for she her. was special. Yeah, right. Oh, he's got his Nobu for yeah. But my friend Richie works there, and he sends it over all the time. You can't but, keep the Nobu. But guys, can't are, keep it. I can't, I've got too much of it. But guys are always ordering the best food for her. Right, right. That's so I, she's used she to this build up. She was, two, she was successful. She made me look like a load. Yes. That's all. Yes. That's all I'm saying. And I'm saying, <laughs> what kind of friend is that? Was she shooting for I, that? I don't know. Well, on some level. I don't think you Why does she protect the boyfriend she's seeing I, now? You know what? I'm trying to no. look for some way to defend her, and I, I don't I'll defend her. I think she felt very comfortable. I have a way. I mean, I'm not blowing You know why she doesn't say anything? I, I have a way of making celebrities feel very comfortable. Get out of here. Right. You, 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 know, you know how you do it's that, Chauncey? You disappear. They don't I did it to Rob, Robin. I did it with you. I did it to you. You know what the interview says to me? <laughs> I'm a young, hot piece of ass, and no way am I interested in this 47-year-old guy. Yeah, right, right. And that's, that's what it says. And, and, I feel, and I'm embarrassed. He's not in my league, and right. I'm letting the world this know. This is what she's saying. Look at how hot I am. Do you Even think Howard Stern can't get me? Try to get me. right, and it's tooting her own horn, but it makes me look at my expense, making me look like a load. And all I've and ever I done, I had to cover up in a big turtleneck, right, to keep him off yeah. me. <laughs> and you know what? In my mind, it's like, hey, I, you know, I'm the guy who, quite frankly, hired you just because I thought you were good on the show, and that's on my only agenda. You know, what? makes me look like I hired her so and, I get in her pants. So. She, I, I won't hang around with her. That's if all. If she's not interested, then why is she even coming over to your house then? Well, so, she she can can so she, she can, can tell that. everyone. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. Big loud mouth. She wanted Howard to make the yeah, first move. Yeah, Howard made the first move. No, nah, she yeah, did it and I did it. Oh, right, whatever. Okay. Well, it, what would be worse if she had a story of how she rejected him? How, yeah. How mortifying would that be? Howard leaned in and kissed me and oh. I said no. I got to get it back on the show. I got to get it back on. <laughs> Get her on. Part two of the interview. Get her on, Get her on and play it back here, okay? Yeah, I like too. Shorty didn't even really ask her any questions. She's volunteered all. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You I can't, can't blame believe... me on this one. He's like, Lila, how are you? Well, I went to Howard's house. Yeah. Wait a minute. It's almost as if I have to make sure this guy never tries it with me again. Yeah. I'm going to talk about it. Exactly. No, oh. she was just waiting for somebody. I mean, if it was the inquirer, like... if it was Chauncey, if it was me, anybody. She, she no, just had the story it's pent up. Howard repellent she's using. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it makes me look like a douche. Patrick, you're on the air. Yeah. Hey, hey when it all comes to the six, the dirty, filthy... No oh. good gold digging whore. Oh. That's a... <laughs> there you go. <laughs> You're not aligning it for us, dude. You angry, too? Oh, it is so upsetting to me. Yeah. I can't believe she made you look like such a schmuck. Yeah, I look like a schmo. <laughs> <laughs> what? I like a turtleneck. <laughs> yeah, I'm so such a deviant, you got to wear a turtleneck. Yeah, that's, the, that's the part I'd be upset about. I can't about. control myself around her. Again, it's her complimenting herself. He's not going to be able to control himself around me. Watch if I me. wear a low-cut top, he's going to be all over Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be I'm gonna be so sexed up that I can't stand yeah. it. Why not a suit of armor? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah and it was almost like, Jassy still, belt. he wants me. Yeah, right. I, I could wear <laughs> dog feces on my face, and he's going to want me. That's how hot I am. She should have put the turtleneck around her mouth, and then maybe you would have been. <laughs> yeah, but what it is is that it's hard, this interview is hard complimenting herself. Yeah, but but yeah. no, the world ain't going to see it that way. You look bad. I'm I look bad. Yeah, I'm sorry people will believe that this actually happened. I look like a schmuck. I'm not saying you are bad, but you look That's right. bad. That's right. Showing the wall you in very funny. That's all. Hey, listen, though. You take one look at her, and you don't look bad, you know? Melvin, you're on the air. Hey, Howard, man, I, you know what? You're pathetic, bro. You're still striking out, man. <laughs> See? <laughs> you know what? You should just go home to that mansion and continue masturbating like you did in your basement. <laughs> I see. You know what? See, you don't heap it on me, dude. I, I don't care. I, I, I still love you, and that's what you get for trying to date a black girl. Man. <laughs>
Yeah, man, I love you. All right, thanks, man. Ah, oh, dude, keep it on me. I deserve it. I deserve hey, Robin, it. I look bad. Robin, honestly, if Howard did this, you know, to you, would you think he was hitting on you? He, uh, well, see, the difference is, do you know the guy or not? Now, he's saying they had a relationship uh, before this, and so it wouldn't have been any big deal if this was just my buddy and he was having me up to his place and we were going to watch the show we work on together. But she's making it like this is the first time they've ever gotten together, and he's trying to wow me. She, she's making a story. She wants yeah. her. It's about yeah. her. It's all about her. Yeah. It, hey. It's all. It, the context makes the difference. Well, it taught me a valuable lesson. Don't let anyone up. Well, I ain't doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take my chances. Yeah. Change the code word. You gotta right. go out there. Well, no, what's, the <laughs> yeah. what's the lesson you learned? The valuable, uh, the valuable lesson I learned. He hates <laughs> Stay away from Johnson. Stay away from me. I'm not sure if I did learn a lesson, actually. Yeah, I mean, really, what would you have done different? You'll, you'll do it again. Yeah, I will. You're right. Maybe I haven't learned a valuable lesson. And we'll keep having those women on our show. And Robin, I must have learned something. You've learned it about Lila, but nobody else. Right. You know, you I learned, learned something about Lila. Yeah, the very right. is don't let Lila on. Right, exactly. <laughs> Stay away from Lila. And I told you that from the beginning. And Ralph did tell me that from the beginning. You should have ordered McDonald's. And next time you'll save some money. Yeah, I should have like thrown it on the table. And go here, exactly. eat this crap. Yeah, throw the exactly burger down the throat. Have to do. That's what you've learned. Yeah. Give them a crappy meal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Give them a happy meal. At least you haven't spent any money. Yeah. Right. The thing to do is if you try, you should have thrown all your clothes all over the apartment. Give her a happy meal. Yeah. Have half the lights broken. Yeah, you right. know what I learned? I learned Lila has a big mouth. That's what I learned. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks everybody. I must take a break. Later. We have in talked and talked.